Hello, it's me, uh, Josiah, and welcome to day two of season four of Coco Summer. Um, thank you guys um, for the comments, by the way. It makes my day, and I know, I just love doing this, and I'm glad to be a part of this with you. And yeah, I hope you stay tuned throughout December. Um, and yeah, so. Before we start anything, I just want to say thank you. And if you have any suggestions, I will have a suggestion week where I just try a bunch of suggestions right in a row. So please comment or DM me or message me, whatever means you have um, of messaging me uh, for some Coco suggestions. I'm willing to try it out and accept it. So yeah. Well, today and tomorrow will be a little bit different. I will actually be gone this weekend. Probably be gone next weekend, but that's a whole nother thing. And so, for these next two days, we're gonna actually do a little competition <clears throat> between two institutions. Instead of me making cocoa, I'm actually gonna buy and compare two different hot cocos from two different places. And so, the first place today, my loyally favorite, as you can tell by the mug, actually, it's Caribou Coffee. We'll see which, uh, I won't mention the other coffee institution, but you probably already know them. And I'm not fond that I'm doing it, but you know what? I'm doing it for you guys. I'm doing it for the content. So, uh, I think that's pretty honorable to me, honestly. It's a lot of jarble. Let's get right into it. Alrighty, so we're in the car here, and as you can see, it's pretty cold, um, and yeah, we're about to head to Caribou right now, and uh, yeah, here we go. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be a long wait. Alright, for Josiah? Yep. Alright, what can I get started for you? Um, might I get a large hot chocolate? Large hot chocolate? Yep. Hi there. Hello. How are you? I'm good. How about you? Good. It's 531. You have a voucher on your account that says if you pay for a small, you get a large. And you did order a large drink. Do you want to pay for a small today? Sure. Yeah. That'd be great. It is 451. Ooh, there you go. But if you'd like to try our drink yet today, you get an extra 10 cents off. Seven. All right. <laughs> All right. Thank you. You too. Bye. All righty. As you can see, we got our hot cocoa, and now it's time to head back to the crib. Here we go. <laughs> All righty. So. As you can see, or maybe not, now you can see, we got our caribou coffee here, or not coffee, uh, hot cocoa here, and it smells like hot cocoa, and here we go. Gotta pour it in the mug. Now that we got our hot cocoa, there's only one thing left to do. Mmm. It's pretty good. It's pretty rich, pretty resolute. It's like a solid standard hot cocoa. I've tried a lot of complex things in the past and for just being a regular hot cocoa, this is kind of like at the top of its level. As far as a cocoa summer rating goes, I'd probably give it, give it a 6.5 out of 10. It is better than just like straight up Milo. However, it is more expensive because you're paying someone to make it. And as even though it is a really, really good hot cocoa, like I should say really good, simple hot cocoa, I've had combinations in the past that are a lot better. If you're at Caribou and you don't want any caffeine, I would definitely get this. Um, this is definitely worth it. Well, that's it for today. I hope you're enjoying the expansive two episodes now. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a wonderful Saturday, and as always, stay cocoa, my friends. <laughs>